Ella, learn how to do this. Okay. We're rolling right now. We're rolling. So they got me saying mean things to you. <laughs> <laughs> so Bill. Yeah. What's going on, bro? Yeah, first question. That question you just asked was pretty good. You think if Kane, you think if Kane was stronger than Abel or just more cunning? I got to brush up on my old testament. I don't really remember that story. I think Kane was probably more sleek and fit. Yeah, you think? Abel was probably just jacked, hot, big bear type. Kind of yeah. trusting. More of an otter, more of a bear type. You think you're kind of just like, you think Abel or, yeah, Abel was more trusting, I guess. Kane was just cunning. Perhaps. Yeah. Ruthless. I think Abel probably had like a tough outer shell, but deep down was like a good person. I think Kane was probably. Yeah, just ripped. <laughs> probably ripped. weighed about like 178 pounds. Just fucking shredded out of And then he mind. just beat the fuck out of Abel. Just threw him off a cliff, I think. I think it was a push-up contest. We think it was a push-up contest. And Abel contest? was like, oh, his, heart gave, out. his heart gave out during the push-up contest. I think, I think Kane dropped a rock on him, dude. I did well. I mean. In the push-up contest? 225 pounds. Well, you don't have to be. Hmm? <laughs> I think in the arena though I would perform better than you What do you mean Which arena are you speaking of the There's world. a lot of arenas bro. Yeah, On the street I think someone would You're talking about street fitness No 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 If we were to hit the push, You're talking about the bars bro We'll do the push ups on the bars if, if In like two separate parts of the city I was walking down the street And you were walking down the street Yeah I think you're more of a target than me What are you talking about Target for what Rape <laughs> Dude Why'd you take it there dude Why'd you take it there Well or just robbery so wait, you? Think I will say this: the goal of fitness is to be able to avoid rape. Unrapeable. That's why. That I is know. the yeah, whole point. Yeah, but it also you're increasing your target as a man. I could say with what as a male on male rape. If you get jacked and buff, people more people want to rape you. I Almost like a Gulliver's Travel kind of thing. Or rip, who was the guy? I think rip man, Van the man rapes more of a domination thing, not like a, a lust. What thing. if it's two guys? What? Two, I'm, I'm talking about like a Rip Van Winkle setup. Who was the guy? Like, I think Gulliver's Travels were like all the little people tied him yeah, up. Yeah, the Lilliputians. Yeah, you, you <laughs> could get gang raped, dude. You could be as big as you want. Somebody True. Gang rape you. I don't think so. And again, like, as, as I'm saying, like, you know, you're, big, you're big and buff. People yeah. might be into that. Yeah. You that, might get a bigger, buffer rapist. True. When you get to prison, you fight the biggest guy. Yeah. When you get on the street, you rape the biggest guy. Yeah, exactly. You got to set the tone for the neighborhood. You got to show everybody. Yeah. Here. Whereas me, they like uh, someone who's going to be like, like a gay rapist sees me operate and he's like, I don't know, that guy seems too cunning. He's like kind of shredded. He's got a gray goatee and he's like kind of shredded still. It's like, I don't, I don't want I think, any parts of that. I think Matt's winning this debate. Yeah, I mean, sees you lumbering down the street, all fucking barrel chested, just like Ugh. he's like, I'm gonna fucking rape that. Guy. I'm gonna teach that guy a lesson. And he would be mad. Like, what's that guy about two twenty five? I can rape him. No, no, I go more <laughs> skunk defense. What is a skunk defense? Well, while you guys are <laughs> modeled off bears <laughs> and whatever, I model myself as just like I'm not even gonna come near that guy. You wear black and white. I wear a skunk. I dress like a skunk. Act <laughs> skunkish. If somebody comes near me, it's like, yeah, you might kill me, but I'm gonna ruin the stink of the block. Yeah, for but you're high profile three days. target. So I'm going to be like, yo, I raped him. You didn't rape that guy. but like, yeah. fucking raped him. I'm telling you. You might be the most vulnerable. You think the most rapeable? The most no. desirable? No. Shane's been coming on to me every week. Shane's strong, dude. <laughs> Shane is strong. I have don't been coming on, to, coming on to Bill. Every time you guys leave, I go straight to I try to fuck Bill. I know what you're up to in here. I don't understand it. Well, it's you won't even let me snuggle while we watch TV. That's fucked up, dude. That's I literally I try to every, two hours down. every single time. He lays two and a half <laughs> both ways. <laughs> Both ways, five hours every single time. Uh, he lays on the corner of the couch. I always try to jump in and put my head on him, mm -hmm. and he does not like it. It, it was always weird to me that chicks did that shit. Like, they'll watch movies together, like... Yeah, like, but, like, under the same blanket, yeah. like... So why not? It's, weird. it's nice. It's not weird. Yeah, it does mean. feel nice, and if you and me did it... Yeah, dude, if you guys... If you just... let me put my head on your lap while we watched a show. <laughs> yeah. While we watched Trump highlights. Yeah. <laughs> that would be sick. Or just pretend like you guys were out on like a mission. It was really cold. Yeah. You guys were like lost, like lone survivors. And it's like, it's just, you guys just being as warm as possible together. I don't think so. Just lone survivor. I, dude, wear gully suits and just cuddle up. Guy like me, I front load my masculinity. So. Wait, what's that mean? I mean, Spade sent me a thing about butches and studs. What's that? <laughs> butch, like <laughs> lesbians yeah, yeah. and studs. And the one was a butch. And he's like, I'm just a total butch. I front load my masculinity. What's so what? what no is, idea, but it sounds good. What's a stud do? A stud, I think they're more cool, or they're just a little black flashier, lesbians. little flashier. Huh? Yeah, studs are black lesbians. Yeah, yeah. The butch is like a, someone rolling up wawa hoagies. Just well, I, like the, I like that we name hor like lesbians the same way like horses. <laughs> We're like, well, if it's black, it's a stud. <laughs> <laughs> it's a white lady with a gelled spike. She's yeah, butch. Yeah, there there was a very weird um, video, and like they were kind of going in how the butches are kind of dying out and they're getting what's happened to the butches kind of pushed out by transgender people. Not that that's a bad thing. They're just saying that's what's happening. 
So wait, no, but you're talking like no one's stoked on the butches or the butches are like, just so, I need a trans. There's a lot less cargo shorts and spikes. Mm. Now they're just going right to the Wawa has no associate managers. managers. <laughs> yeah. yeah, butchers do all like dress like they shop at GameStop. Yeah. Like oh they, like they every GameStop like Guy is, Fieri. Yeah. True. They all look exactly like Guy Fieri. You think they all eat burgers and like oh raw. Yeah. Like, this oh, is how suck they're my acting dick. This shit's so good. You think they're I think they're all transing right now. It's a lot of them. That's le- what they're saying. People who used to be lesbians now are just becoming dudes. The art of the butch is slowly dying. What? Yes. No. Dude, I swear to God. What the fuck? You still have your studs and all that stuff, and you still have your lipstick lesbians, but a lot of those chicks are just- Love a good stud. Our blue-collar yeah. lesbians are going distinct. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, the liberals. They're destroying our hard-working butch. Just our Republican lesbian fucking- It's going to be like the, like the rust belt. We're going to have that with butches. There's the butch belt. <laughs> All the bushes left. The factories left. North, <laughs> Northern Florida. Yeah. Just yeah. towns Damn. decimated with zero bushes. I remember that's all you used to see. Like, bushes? Going bushes? down the beach and stuff. I was like, oh, yeah, that's just a lesbian. Yeah, you they catch a lot like of dudes. bushes on the way down the beach in their Jeeps. Yeah. See, uh, you could black, identify white, them. On. You, yeah. You could identify them as like a child, as a young child. You'd be like, something's different. Yeah. There'd be like, I remember uh, going to my sister's basketball games. There were several butches that would love to girls basketball, obviously. True. When I was a kid, I didn't realize why. It's got to be the best, dude. When you're a girl and they're like dolls and all of a sudden they let you just fucking scramble after a jump ball. You're like, this is what I'm talking oh, about. Oh, I'm in. <laughs> I'm Finally, some you action. Fucking... Yeah, dude. Yeah. You, get to fucking, you feel a girl like elbow you and you're like, yes. Oh. Ah. Oh, fuck. Just that moment, dude. But I think that's when girls realize they're lesbians when they're wrestling a ball out from an opponent. Like when it's a jump ball and they get it, they're like. I think I like girls. I'd rather you keep fighting for the ball. Yeah, I don't even dude. want the ball. I want you. Ooh. Think of the think of you and me. <laughs> yeah. Everybody leaves. Yeah. Yeah. You're like Shane. Check out this show I'm watching, man. <laughs> and I'm like, whoa, this is awesome. And then I snuggle up with you and we watch it and we order Grubhub together and we watch it. But we don't have sex. No, not at all. Dude. No, it's not about have that. Sex. It's Boy. about dudes just being comfortable around each other. We could come. Yeah. Separate. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Back to back, like Bubba and Gump. yes, back to back, just fucking jerking. I never did that with my friends. I it's talking about what you're about, to, like good business ideas. All the kids you jerk from like off. fucking Glenn Olden and shit. They all used to like jerk off with each other and have sex with the same. You missed girl out, the same bro. Time. That, that yeah. was that was before your never time. Did that. That's you guys, just boy. That's front loading masculinity. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it really is, dude. Heavily. That's because you guys, we you got the internet by then, so you could safely retreat. We had one tape. There was one porno, you know, there was a bunch of dudes. It was like. And bro, only man. one kid had one tape. Yeah. So you only got to see that. You only got to go to his house like yeah. once every two weeks. I had one night in Paris on portable DVD. Yeah. yeah but you were but, still kind of behind. No, but what he's saying is you had your own porn when we were young lads. Oh, yeah. It was just Cinemax to a. One a. kid had house. one porn and yeah. you got to wait. You had to go to his house and wait till 4 a.m. to watch yeah. it. Yeah. And of course, you're all going to fucking unload. There's no time. There's I mean, no... it was like Navy SEAL. You'd be up for like, you'd be like 1600. Yeah. You'd all be laying in just, the waves. Yeah. I, I was there. At... Just laying in the ocean until the parents go to sleep. I would then... just stare at TV guide until my eyes bled. Like when I went over to Pat's house, it'd be like two in the morning. I'd just watch for TV. Scrolling? Right? Yeah. Just the thing going Swing, down on dude. channel 64. Fuck, I remember that. Just <laughs> checking the schedule and being like, fuck, it's fucking Batman. Yeah. For yeah. three hours. We but you're like, Dark Knight Rises, then it's Taxi Cab Confessions after that. He says, it says TVMA. I don't know what this Taxi is. Taxi Cab Confessions, you can get one off. They tricked me a few times with that because I thought it was like going to be a porno. Yeah, I, I've jerked off to like the hooker documentaries. It's like, here comes a little cinnamon. Yeah. Oh yeah. AC <laughs> She's just rolling down the thing. Having a horrible as as, night. As soon as I see that car shake, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> Fap. true. The kids don't know. You had to wait till the scene came. Yep. You didn't get to choose the scene like you do now. Yeah. You had to lie and wait. Yeah. Yep. And then when it hit, fuck, 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 I don't know how long the scene's gonna last. Audio, dude. I don't know how long the scene's gonna last. I gotta get it out. Yeah, man. That's front loading masculinity. Yeah, yeah I gotta practice that. So you, you, yes, you I can help out. you and me. Can exactly. Dude. You're a butch. I'm a bit of a butch. You are very. I actually stud. am more trans. Matt's more stud. You think I'm actually? Yeah, I'm a yeah you're a black. Spade lesbian. also claims stud. He said stud? I'm bush. Yeah, I told Spade he wasn't a stud, but he's <laughs> he's, he's stud. He is. Yeah. You, you, think, you think Spade? Fuck, you think yeah. Spade's bush? I like this. You didn't know this? Yeah. Do you think yeah. Spade's bush? I told him he he's butch, but <laughs> <laughs> he's not having that. He's yeah, I ended up looking like most of those ladies that would come watch yeah. girls' high school basketball. <laughs> <laughs> they fill out black beaters very nice. That's what I was saying, dude. In a Jeep Wrangler, black beater. With Big a- J is butch. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he fills out a black beater. He's butch as fuck. 
Yeah. The whole Legion of Skank squad is pretty butch. Dave Smith might be a bit of a stud. Yeah. Well, studs are black ladies. No, no, they can be white girls. You can, yeah, you can be a white. It's just, stud. it's just how you present yourself. Really, I don't think so. For uh, some reason, can we hit pause? I'll show you the video. I'm gonna pull up one right now. Can we hit pause real quick? No, I believe you. Okay. Gomez you is see, a stud. The video is Gomez is, a stud. Gomez is transitioning into stud. He was a butch for a while. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He had those wide, childbearing hips. <laughs> That's, just, that's the shame about a butch, as you can tell, they'd be a great mother, physically. Oh, yes. Caring. True, dude. They are caring. They pretend to not be caring. They say, get back to the end of the line at the Wawa. <laughs> it's like, Sir, I know. where's your stamp? Yeah. It's like, I see the twinkle. I know guy. there's a mother in there. I'm white stud happy, lesbian. Dude. Dear white lesbians, you are not studs. Thank you. By Tag Magazine. Ooh. Thank you. Thank you, Tag Magazine. The butches and studs who defied the male gaze and redefined. Yeah, that wasn't a real hard... Defined. <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. Yeah, well, I mean. Oh, hell yeah, dude. What? There we go. There's a white stud. Yeah, that's yeah. a hot fucking white nah, stud. A stud, bro. Now we have something to say. Uh, yeah, I looked it up and it seems like studs are just butch, but they're like, uh, they're more fashion forward. Okay. Ah. Yeah, they, this looks like Bieber with somebody photoshopped a hot lady's head on it. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I'm actually in the, with the chick's head. Yeah, which confuses me because I'm kind of into studs. Yeah. I'd like to kiss her, and yeah. it's just a guy. No, it's not, but it's a girl. I know, Stud. but I'd like to kiss that. First of all, please, I beg you. <laughs> <laughs> you got to go get the small of her back, and then if she doesn't, grab her face and be like, just to let you know, I'm open to relationships with stud studs in their 20s. It's actually, you don't pluralize it. Oh, just Many stud. studs is stud. Is it stud? Yes. Is it really? It's like yes. Deer? Yes. I like that. Dude, studs are There's fucking... several stud in here. Studs, basically, if you want to be a... <laughs> if you want to be butch, you have to just wear, like, you know, like kind of like blue collar, like a yeah. trucker kind of cap or like uh, some sort gas of uniform. Station pan- Excuse you. Gas station pants, <laughs> Timberland boots, yes. white tee, yep. something like that. And if you want to be a stud, you have to dress like a TJ Maxx mannequin. <laughs> <laughs> Polo Assassination Association, whatever fuck that is. Which, that's exactly why I like them. True. I used to love those mannequins. They're hot, dude. I, I do remember squeezing mannequin tits as Did a boy. You? Oh, yeah. you, you touched? Mm-hmm. I, I remember doing it in the front window <laughs> at Boscov's. At the local Boscov's. Boscov's? I, was, I remember being in the front, and the what? sidewalk was outside, and I was in the front <laughs> squeezing tits. Dandelion? I, yeah, I was front-loaded masculinity. Yeah. <laughs> I used to go by the bras. I don't know what to tell you. you the bras at like Target and stuff, and just get like one finger under like, like that. Oh, hit it real quick and keep walking. Walking through the bra section, I was fu- I still get fucked yeah, up. Yeah, I still get it. I saw I saw women's That's underwear I can recently. What smoking DMT is like when I was like nine years old walking through the bra section. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy, different, dude. different dimensional Everything beings. Vibrating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, you walk through. You're trying to get to like the the, the young men's like fitness section. Your mom takes a shortcut to the bra section. You're just like, oh, and then you lose your mom, and then real it. panic takes in. Oh. You've been out front squeezing mannequin tits. And you're like, oh shit, I'm lost. I'm never gonna get home, dude. I I tell Brittany all the time. I'm like, I get kind of chubbed up when I walk through the bra section. Fucks Obviously. me up. Fucks me yeah, bra sorry, underwear, w- women's panties. Yeah, man. Now Victoria's dude, a Victoria's Secret magazine came women's to our house. Panties, dude, came to our house, and Brittany Yours? was like, "Our house, yeah." It was to Brittany. Yeah, came to our house, and I was like, "Yeah, stash that, bro." She's like, "What are you talking about?" And I had to tell her like, "I will fucking." Back in the day, I used to come all over those things. Oh yes, I would jerk off and just jizz all over the models. It's crazy that everybody just instinctively jizzes on things. Yeah, dude, man. it's even weird. Got it. Like, like now that uh, like all that Epstein came out, I like, came on a Maxim magazine. Same here. I Fuck left yeah, it dude. on the under yeah. our yeah. toilet. Billy left the fucking. And my cruster. brother found it. He left a cruster, dude. He found it. <laughs> I got her pregnant and just left. Billy, it there. Billy yeah, left yeah, you're the emerald. Deadbeat. You're yeah. deadbeat to dude, the Maxim. Billy like left I the said, it's like tablets. smoking DMT. I did that and I just like <laughs> floated back to my room. Yeah, dude, those things look like the Ten Commandments. Yeah, been Maxim been Maxim just <laughs> holding two, <laughs> holding two hard sheets, two hard Maxims that have been just solidified. But by dude, oh, that uh, Maxim was great. The oh, yeah. one, one guy who's like heavily tied up with Epstein is the model, like the modeling agent for. You Victoria's think he's hot? Secret. You're saying no. Just <laughs> But remember, See, that's the other those, thing you those, do and you say a lot of gay stuff. And then when I come to cuddle, you're like, no way. I don't say gay stuff. You just you said do that say guy gay was hot like sometimes. a model. True, my bad. Uh, yeah, dude, they have, dude, if like, me, when I was, hold on, I'm sorry. I keep cutting you off. You okay, fucking, you're the comedian. God. I'm just a fucking schmo. Go ahead. Don't be a jerk to me. Don't treat me like this in front of everybody. 
that. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, what if it came yeah. out that me and me and Bill were fucking after every episode? I support you. I would fully support you. See, no one I think care. it's time for I think it's time for men, heterosexual men, to redefine their sexuality. No one would even don't goof though on the <laughs> goof on air. I actually, yeah, I, I, we've had this conversation before. I can gay chicken all day. When it gets done to me, I'm instantly just like, dude, just no. touch each other's penises for two seconds. No, man. Yo, what the ultimate, the, the ultimate. This would be a. Sick- you have a daughter. <laughs> this is <it's> so what? <laughs> You're smuddling, pe- you're peddling smut right now. Yeah, you dude. Get your words out. You're salivating so hard. Think about Shane touching your penis. Do you, you have, you have pre-cums? Hands. Do you have pre-cums? Who's harder pre-com? right now? Who's uh, harder right now? Nah, I'm like fucking 2.5 inches right now. Just the angle of the seat. Yeah, this, this is, is a right guaranteed penis maker. <laughs> <laughs> this is a penis maker. The softer you guys are saying you are, the harder I, I think you are. I can't believe how soft I am right now. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm pretty... I Too much tea up. in this room. That's really funny to throw that in Matt's face. What? If he says anything bad, you have a daughter. <laughs> like, know, that's, that's smut. Yeah, but dude, do you remember the Victoria's Secret catalogs had the teen section in lingerie? Like, I was in high school. So did the Coles magazine. Dude, but, I mean, Victoria's Secret was fucking lingerie. True. And they were the girls that were hot. <laughs> like, I was 15, 16, 17, losing 19, my shit. Yeah. Wow. I didn't even think of that. Yeah, they had the Coles Juniors. there's a guy who would, the Coles like, Juniors, dude. Seek them out and hire them. Yeah, man. Are you talking about some guys get all the stuff? luck? Yeah, I forget what yeah, her name was. The model J- Jelaine. Had. No, no, it was, it's a. I forget his name. God damn it. His job was to seek teen, was young a, teen models. True. Yeah, that's anyone. Oh, at, people in the mall who like. Yeah. God, think of like his him Isn't and his wife. Like, done. oh, I got another day at the office. This is gonna suck. I called a guy. Sure. Yeah. Anyway, I'm casting 15 year olds <laughs> in underwear. I yeah, called a guy. Think about that. There was a poster in Clark Park when I was doing the house. I was living in Uncle Dan's and I was talking to Spade on the phone. He sent me the number. The guy was like specifically mo- taking modeling pictures for nine to 15 year olds. What? And I was like, hey, I just want my daughter to do this. And like, I, I just want to make sure you're safe. And he goes, oh, yeah, I'm completely safe. And I just kept going, well, my wife thinks you're weird as fuck and an absolute <laughs> creep. But I would never say that. <laughs> I think this is a great idea and I want her to do this. But my wife thinks you're going to jerk off to these. And now, you really prank called weird. this guy by yourself, right? In my basement. In my yeah. mom's basement. Yeah. What, did, what did he say? He was just, he talked to me the whole time. Like, this is a sickness, dude. If you're willing to How long ago fucking, was this? Uh, two years ago. Yeah, that's Dude, fucked up. Dude, you man. making a this you prank calling a guy by yourself might be weirder. Yeah, obviously. It, I, it's I awesome. It's so I'm funny. Not a pedophile. True, True. <laughs> but it's so funny that you were. You I, was I was recording. Oh, all right, all right. right, right, right. Look at the early Patreon. All right. Oh, I apologize. Fuck. Is that on the Patreon? No, no. I I tried to find an old tape call, but I didn't have it. I Damn. tried recording. I didn't know you were recording. I literally thought you were okay. just just by yourself. Oh, you just done it anyway, bro. Just ta- ta- that's not attacking you at all. I'm just, it's just funny yeah, to get your you rocks. I would never, come on, man. Called, he called you worse than a pedophile. How what? about that push up competition? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> we yeah, just both dropped right? and did fifty. Andrew, Chris, Cuomo brothers. Yeah, you think I'm a face grabber, back grabber? I think so. Yeah, <laughs> dude, you're you're begging people. Touching a girl's back poker. is you should be fired from public office immediately. Especially during Women's Month, bro? Yeah, good point. You know how hard women have been impressed? Very. Dude, I actually bugged out on this the other day. I was So I, I, I've been I've been really cutting down the weed intake. But the other day, I, and it sounds so fucking... Oh, all right. Sorry. It sounds so lame. But if you take enough CBD oil, you can kind of get stoned. <laughs> okay, it was because I, I got some from my friend's mom. And, you know, sometimes cause there's allowed to be a little bit of THC in it, like a very little bit. It's like I, the equivalent of drinking mouthwash for an alcoholic. Yeah. I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> it really is. I'm telling you. I, dude, I was like... <laughs> I, it only takes me with edibles, a little, a little goes a long way. So if I take yeah. a little, whatever. Mm-hmm. And I was like, so I was getting it from my friend's mom. He was like, you know, she's kind of nervous. She doesn't know. I was like, I'll, I'll hold those. <laughs> I'll, I'll hold those just to make sure, just to give you, because I'm pretty yeah. sensitive to it. And I wasn't like whacked, but I was sitting there. And all of a sudden, I, when I'm really stoned on an edible, the world, so, it starts to look like I have jello over my head where I'm just kind of like, <laughs> oh man. Dude. Dude. So I'm eyelids? sitting there, I'm sitting there and I'm just like, wow. Cause I, I was doing a thing for uh, the psych and all stuff. And I'm, I'm like, the whole idea was like how we've lost like sources of meaning, how we used to be like kind of trapped under like tyrannical systems of like, yeah. you know, like we had guys who could cut our head off and we disagreed, blah, 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 yeah. burn at the stake. And I was like, I got to the women part and it was like, and then like women just like were basically locked in their house. And I was like, fuck dude, women didn't vote till like 1912 all around there were there were a group that got oppressed yeah, dude. worldwide like no i'm saying like yeah, they were turns ma- out we had it right yeah. until they were, 1912 they were, a great idea they were a majority and what happened after 1912 
World War One, World War Two, <laughs> Holocaust, <laughs> Soviet Union, <laughs> the greatest atrocities. The thing ever. is all downhill from there. They were oppressed as a collective, a, such a large group. They were like universally oppressed. Yes, and you hear about it, you go like, yeah, you guys can vote now. Like no one, you don't even think about it. You're just like, yeah, yeah. And I just thought about that. And I was just like. Whoa! Yeah, holy! Because back then shit. they'd be like, "We should let women vote." And We've been be humans like, for so long. <laughs> we had it right. Someone fucked it up in 1912. Someone simped. It was like, "Yeah, <laughs> I'll let you vote." I'll, I'll tell you, you fucked vote. it up. There was a bunch of butches. Yes, they <laughs> Susan, Susan Butch Anthony. That's what the beast stands for. <laughs> <laughs> it was worldwide that everyone was yeah. like, "Let the fuck out!" No, no, no. Yeah. For the most part, dude. We had a kid on my freshman football team that had a spiky hair, mm-hmm. and we were like, "You look like I call it." I was like, "You look like a Butch lesbian," and his name was Butch throughout high school. <laughs> Literally, his first name was to every like to teachers. They changed his name to Butch, dude, <laughs> because of that. <laughs> Oh, but what I wanted to say about the, I forgot all about Butch, dude. <laughs> Butch ruled. He was a great bro. Clearly. Uh, he rolled with it, too. He was like, Butch, sick nickname. Hell yeah. yeah. That is a sick nickname. Uh, that fucking, I can't, I can't microdose. Oh, how was it? I got fucked up. Really? Yeah. So I, got, get, I got high. What you got to do is take a little less out and yeah. then put it in. But yeah, I mean, you don't have to do anything. I got high and I was, I was driving back to New York <laughs> <laughs> and I was on the turnpike and I was like, dude, I'm fucking high. Like Russ Cole and Drew <laughs> Texas <driving>. season one. <laughs> How were the tunes? The tunes were incredible, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I, dude, I, I was driving. I was like, these tunes aren't this good. I'm definitely high as hell. Uh, what were you listening to? Uh, fuck, I can't remember. I really can't remember. Damn. But oh, that's so funny. it was enough that I was I was very high. I had to go to a rest stop. <laughs> this rest stop, I didn't even get anything. I just walked around Eyes the rest. I walked to a rest stop and I was just like, "Geez, dude, I can't micro this." Well, it was so funny. He's like, "I'm not feeling anything," and then you're like, "Anyway, here's a memory I haven't thought about in 23 years." Oh my years. god, it was dude. so funny. Yeah, that episode. <laughs> that by the end room, of it, I was like, "That Whoa. locker room made me laugh so hard." We were like. I was in the fucking women's locker room. I'm like, thanks, mom. I'm looking, I'm looking at a lady and I'm seeing her bush. I'm like, you're sitting there. You're like, was that my mom? <laughs> I laughed. That night I was going to bed and I thought about that and la- chuckled to myself. Dude, by the end of that episode, I was definitely getting high. It's, you, for sure. You get altered for sure. Yeah. But again, there's some people that take that. And this is like the weirdest I know. part. They go, oh, that's fucking nothing. I don't even feel it. And it's like, you're just, your body. Well, that's what I called like, Spud as like a. Cause I know he had done it and he it was like, it's nothing. He was like, day. it's nothing. It's nothing. And I was like, dude, I'm high. I know I'm high. Yeah. And then I, I was paranoid. Yeah. It was that type of high. It was like weed for me. It really? felt like weed. Yeah. And normally I can take mushrooms pretty it's well. It's a little bit though. It was yeah. a little bit that made me feel slightly paranoid to the point where I was like, this is how paranoid I was. I was like, is Matt fucking with me? And this is <laughs> in this. No, not that I was high. I was like, is this a placebo? And I'm being a pussy, oh, no. and he's tricking me to act like a pussy. I was literally thinking that. Damn. <laughs> I walked around a rest stop, and I was like, what the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> I got like a coffee at like nine. <laughs> Dude, it, was, it ended up being a bad night. Really? I mean, it was oh, funny. I was, I was, no, it wasn't like a negative experience. It was just funny that I was high. That's, I'm telling you, that's the pathways of surrender. You ha- I'll get to that. The problem for me is, and again, even the littlest amount, I'm sitting there, everything's normal, and then it's not normal, and I go... Go back to normal. And you're yeah. Like, too bad. So you have to completely. It's I. It's basically the predator. You have to be totally mentally still and just let it pass. And then that becomes your normal where you're like, oh, this is sweet. Yeah. I get caught between the two worlds and I go, make it go back to the other one. And you just get set up for a never ending struggle that ends with basically the same thing. That's why I like drugs that leave you no choice. Yeah. yeah. You know, just take what? a little Molly. You're just like, whoo. <laughs> There's no <laughs> point of you. That's like, I wish I could go back. True. You're yeah. just like, I'm in. Except when you're at a concert. That's hot as fuck. Oh, yeah. You took Molly at a concert. That happened to me. Oh, my God. Mm. Dude. You got too hot. You might have had, yours might have been cut with speed, though. Definitely. Yeah, apparently that happens. That's yeah. why I'm nervous we, about that. We were, we were at Made in America, the first one You got to let the evil happened. hippies be the, the space True. champs. Yeah. True, yeah. Launch them up and see what happens. True. On our way in, they were system. carting a guy out like fucking pussy. And then me and Pat were like in some like dubstep thing. And like, well, this is fucking <laughs> awesome. And then like, I was like, I'm pretty fucking hot. I was like, I can hear my heart. I was like, oh, fuck. And yeah. I just rolled out. Well, that's God, how people are. I looked it up because I, you know, I'm new into the drugs. Yeah. And yeah. I wanted to make sure it wasn't something you could die from. Mm-hmm. And it's, Jeez, you don't, you can't. With your glow sticks. Yeah, I love glow sticks, dude. <laughs> don't tempt me. Uh, and it's because people overheat. It's pretty that's safe. That's yeah, what I happens. Thought I thought it's pretty safe. The only you, problem is street drugs could be cut. And I, my cousin took a. Uh, Something one time, one of my cousins, I don't want to, you know, I have a bunch of them. 
but it was a long time ago. He took these things and it ended up just being speed. He was like, I was up for three days. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's very funny. They were called white Zoros. They were, they were supposed to be e bombs, and he was like, they, I just stayed up. Yeah, the shit days. we oh. took was when Silk Road was delivering everything. Like, yeah, when I was at Temple, Silk Road was delivering shit yep. like this kid, no problem. Yeah, pretty wild. That's cool. They're going to come out with a movie about that. Oh, they really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. They got a Silk Road movie coming out. Tight. Yeah. But yeah, no, dude, I heard good things about Molly. Just powders and shit. I'm just like, yeah, I like that. Like yeah, I can't. I can't stuff. endorse it, but yeah. I can't. And it, it does rule. Yeah, dude. I told you. I heard nothing about good things. Yeah. I told Shane today, I enjoy base reality. This is cool for me. I have been really enjoying base reality re- recently. That's the thing. <laughs> I, I like cut back. Well, that was the problem. I took, dude, I, I think my system was like wiped of weed and I had like, Zero weed tolerance. And again, I, I know people make fun of me, but I, I took, I was trying to protect this old lady to make sure that I was like, cause I have a sensitive system and I'm like, if I don't, if I'm cool, she'll be totally fine. And I like, you know, took it more than I normally would. And I'm sitting there, I'm bugging out. You were doing me. her a favor. Yeah. Maybe, you know, I was taking, I was taking my, <laughs> anytime weed. I get high, I'm like, this is for, this I, call, is I for now everyone. call them spiritual experiences. I had a yes. spiritual, I was like, I was actually had a spiritual experience, but I, uh, <laughs> I think I kind of use CBD like weed methadone sometimes too, where I'm like, I just need it in my system. I think and that's I the like, point of it. Sort Not of. really, but that's definitely a... You can't use it like that. Yeah. But, dude, I, I'm telling you, man, it like... I think there, this one had a little more THC than normal, because I was just like... Because, again, they, you know, they, they could be a little more. Who knows? Um, dude, I, I bug out on the... I'm like, fuck, dude. All of women got oppressed for so long, and I'm like, holy shit. And I'm like, and literally nobody cares. When anyone brings it up, you're like, okay, shut up. Like, you can, you can just be like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, it's just... I was like, damn, this is fucking crazy. And then I had it... Like, I come upstairs, and Brittany was like... Can you go to Whole Foods? I need to blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, yeah, I'll go down there. Dude, I'm walking. I'm like floating in my body. That's because uh, I think I was on empty. So I was like fasting too. So I'm just like kind of, I'm spaced out, dude. You're probably very hungry. I walk into Whole Foods. I had head, I'm listening to headphones. I was like listening to music. Well, oh, by the way, the song I think is called, uh, fuck, dude. It's called Emerge, I think. Chill. If they played it, dude. <laughs> you, you have Speaking to. of fasting, I was, I looked up how long it would take to die from not eating. What'd you get? Uh, some dude on a hunger strike went like 79 days. Dude, there's a guy who fasted which for like the IRA guys. so funny to just be like, just sitting there and be like, I haven't, I'm hungry as fuck. I haven't eaten in uh, <laughs> two months. I think <laughs> two months. I think the record is, I think some guy made it almost a year. He took like supplements and shit though. Yeah, that was that dude who lost like a ton of weight, right? Yeah, he, but he also, yeah, he had yeah. like 300 yeah, pounds. Yeah, I'm talking less. just straight up. Yeah, some dude. Prison. I can do twenty four. I do twenty four hour fast, and like by the end of them, you're fucking. You get lightheaded and weak. Yeah, you get. You, yeah. I've I fasted to the point where I get tingly. Like my whole extremities are tingly. <laughs> this is a song playing, dude. <laughs> it's from Westworld. Ah, dude. So I'm listening to this. It kind of picks up in a little bit. <laughs> so I'm playing. Oh, this. that would crush. You're I'm, JB from Grandma's. Boy. Yeah. <laughs> dude. <laughs> Walk in. I get. I got how the vocals kick in. Dude, it was so funny. His vocals. Yeah. So I'm just. I get out. This is me parking my car right now. I'm just fucking like. I don't know, dude. I think the shit might be a little stronger than I thought. <laughs> and you know, I'm like lightheaded. Damn. Matt and Shane's about to go to another level. This is- <laughs> so I'm just sitting oh. there. Rules, dude. Yeah, send me that. I'll be listening to that tonight. <laughs> dude, this song fucking rules. So I'm sitting there, I park my car, I'm just walk, listening to music like, damn, this is this is crazy. So I walk in, I'm in the middle of Whole Foods, I'm like looking, I'm FaceTiming, uh, my niece FaceTime me, she starts, she's like asking me, she was like doing the octopus head, showing me how to do that, and I'm just like laughing, like, that's so funny. Yeah. And then I get in the middle of Whole Foods, and all of a sudden I go, I don't have a mask on. <laughs> oh. I just wa- I was just patriot status, yes. walking around, it was just like... Oh, I totally <laughs> forgot. Now, you know, there you, you like, exited the matrix. <laughs> 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 I was in the middle They're of all Agent Smith. I was in like the baking aisle, just like, oh shit, yeah, it was nothing but Agent Smith. And I, dude, I didn't even notice anyone looking at me or anything. I was just walking in, just like you have enough. Co- it's like those people just like, walk into bars and go into the kitchens. Like if you have enough, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what it'll work. I, I think it was. I was walking with such confidence that people did were just like. It just glitched. Yeah. It's like that uh, experiment where the gorilla enters the thing and you don't notice it. And the kids <laughs> oh, yeah, are passing yeah, the yeah. basketball. Dude, it was so fucking funny. I, I was like, holy shit, I forgot. Yeah, that... that uh, Listening to that was so... That would have got me. That would have got me. Yeah. Too. I was the, in the uh, zone, dude. And you were doing the face the FaceTime octopus? She was, she was doing octopus and I couldn't do they it. They probably so. thought you were insane then. I think so, <laughs> dude. I'm being like... 
aggressively <laughs> walking around. Like, I had headphones, so I'm loud as yeah. fuck being like, I can't get the octopus on my phone. I think Damn. I have an old model. So you were yeah. just black. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got so high you were black for <laughs> 10 minutes. <laughs> that is a hilarious scenario to watch in Acme. If like one black dude walks in, everyone's just like, <laughs> uh, we talking about with the they get no nervous mask? as fuck to say anything to with them. the no mask. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah, they don't. Well, it is fucking hilarious. Yeah, they've written articles. One. They've written articles saying that they should be excused from it. Right. I've seen <laughs> it. They'd be like, we shouldn't. You know, we shouldn't make them. The other thing that's been pissing me off lately we should, because I was talking to Spade about like the glory of Genardi's. Did you have Genardi's where you were? No, I don't think so. Yeah. Really? Genardi's. Yeah. Genardi's ruled better than Whole Foods tenfold. Oh, and okay. All this like well, you you were buying it in like nineteen ninety four, so the standards are different. Hold on. Yeah. It ran like... I appreciate that you defended Whole Foods. Yeah. No problem. Everything was good. All tarts. They had that... It okay, was, I see what you're saying. They were crushing it. And it was called Genardi's? Genardi's, yes. <laughs> you guys didn't call it anything else? No, dude. No, dude. But they would... Seems like a layup. They crushed it there. No problem. None of this like weird like clap for me shit that Whole Foods does. Like The Whole Foods people are clowns compared to the tarts that worked at Genardi's. They had actual... They were the yeah, best. Yeah, yeah. Baggers, they had, they had specials. Held it down. All they day held long. It down, they had dude. Sam's. It was, it's so it was much Sam's better Club. It was, yes. it was Sam's, <laughs> it was Sam's Club. Sam's Club. Held it down. Some friendly convo. All, yeah. They held it down. It's tough. just crazy that they sit there like, you, you have no idea how hard it is to work at a Whole Foods or anything. It's like, dude, Gennardi's existed. Like, flawlessly existed. Yeah, I went to a- This isn't that hard. They crushed it. Went to a retarded movie theater, and it was like that. It was crazy. Amazing Everybody service. was retarded. Yeah. And they were just, they were stoked. Yes, dude. It was great. And then a retarded guy farted in the back of the movie theater, <laughs> like loudly. And it was the- f I mean, it's a joy. It was incredible. It was me and Soder on the road. And we were like, there was like four people in the theater and a guy fucking uncorked <laughs> the loudest fart. We were just dying laughing. And we didn't realize he was retarded until after the movie. I so looked hard. at him and he was up and down, zipping his jacket, kind oh. of like nervousness because <laughs> of the fart. I mean, dude, they're a joy, dude. Tarted people, autists, they, really, they are they are an absolute joy. One of the rest so stops fun. on the way home I hit is autistic people at work. Is that They have a big sign for it, and they like sell Annie Ann's pretzels. And there's a sign that says autistic people at work. Love it, dude. Yes. Pretty great. Yeah, Love it. They're elite when it comes to that shit. Anything dude, yeah. involving like hospitality or like shelf stocking, elite. When I see him, yeah. like, oh, else, man, like when I see him, I go. American spirit breaks. Get it, boys. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Can you imagine Lewis working? Lewis? At like Lewis, just ah, uh, he's not he's not a work guy. Yeah. yeah, but he would be. He'd be great. He's at more it. of a manager. I don't yeah, think he'd be on. True, the floor. true. Sam would be great at yeah hospitality. Yeah. One of like the a best Cold shows Stone ever. style place where you go in. Remember they they, they sing and like little jingles and shit. Yes. Yeah. There was a Starbucks I in San Antonio when I was in there, I was there for four days and every day I went to the Starbucks and this dude every day was like, Hello, welcome to Starbucks and every time I was furious. Really? Yeah, I'm he was fuming. not retarded. I was fuming. <laughs> he's like, What are you mad about? I was like, I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, it was he had a snow hat pulled back a little. Pissing you off. Yeah, it pissed me off. He was a hipster that was Yeah, doing sometimes the, I yeah. get into it as a fucking like fuck you thing. Yeah, yeah. You should have grabbed them over the counter. I did. I said, you give a fucking give me a cold brew. <laughs> <laughs> Night, knock it off with the niceties. Shane. That's my name. Say it. Damn, you know, when you got to give me a name. Am I excited for Texas? What, reopening? Yes. You're done with the COVID. Dude, I got called I got called an idiot because the CDC said flu deaths are almost non-existent. Yeah, yeah they, said they're they're wearing, down. they said they're down super low. Because we're wearing a mask. and they're coming, they're coming back. I'm a truck driver. I have no idea what I'm talking about, but. Come on. I'm just a truck driver. You're going to believe that? That's what someone told me. I'm I right. mean, it makes perfect sense. What's wrong with that? Then why the fuck didn't we wear a mask our whole lives instead of getting flu shots and doing all this fucking research? Fair enough. All we had to do is wear a mask. Thousands, if not millions, would have I was back saved. when it was gay, though. Yeah, yeah. masks are, was just for Asians. It doesn't make sense. Like, anyone arguing at this point. Right. Like, You're saying, like, the, the biotechnology. The logic is just gone. Yeah, the biotechnology. Third world countries are running absolutely fine. Not fine, because well, they're the third fuck, world countries, yeah. but... <laughs> Well, they're fucked. They're like economically fucked. That is funny when people say like, don't you care about lives? It's like, well, if we depress the economy, everyone's fucked. old, elderly, first world Americans, it, it, it creates tons like, of Cuomo wrote a world. book. Did Which he? Cuomo? Which, Which one Cuomo? Are you? Andrew. Well, hey, I mean, my brother's in right now. My brother's in a bit of a situation, obviously. So I, I can understand yeah. it. But, you know, conflict of interest. Conflict of interest. That's you what don't want to do it. I, I got you. I, that's the conflict. I'm, I'm the Cuomo. That, He's you know. legitimately not allowed to interview him. What do you mean? Like CNN won't allow it right now. 
That guy's in some hot fucking water. Who? Andrew Cuomo. Is that the face toucher? I don't know what the difference yeah. between the two. So the governor. The, but his brother, apparently, they were saying, CNN, apparently CNN hasn't been running a lot on this. I was talking to my boy just before I came here. He was Obviously. He had Fox Blair, and he was like, CNN has not been running. They're saying, like, oh, CNN's been running. He's like, Pfft. Barely covering this. Bill Maher just did some weird shit about like cancel culture. Like he must have something in like coming at him because he's. Like, I don't know. I, I watched it. I thought it was like, good. I thought it was good. It was. He good, came out with something a couple of years ago. Yeah. that was pretty good. I mean, it's basically the he was singing he was that way different song a little while ago. Now all of a sudden, he's like, dude, I mean, cancel culture. He, this is kind of stupid. He no, kinda, he's been against it for a while. Yeah, he kind of defended me. Did he? I think during my thing, he had oh, one yeah, of those segments. Allegiance. Anybody that defended me is. Rad. <laughs> I watched him do it like three care years that he has ago. Kid was, Love Productions. There was a clip, and I was like, "Oh, he does Kid Love." No, his company name Last is minute. Kid Love Productions. What Doesn't do mean he's a that? pedophile, dude. I mean, hey, dude. Would you what do you think of Kid Rock? Would you, would you rename Gillian? What do you Keys think of Kid Rock? Boy Love. Yeah. What do you think, think of Kid Rock? Kid Rock, dude. Kids Rock. That's not pedophile. Why? Why not you? Boy, not what do you, you don't love? Not what about Trick kids? Loves the Kids? No. Trick Love the Kids. Trick Love the Kids, dude. Come on, guys. I don't know. What about Trick Loves the Kids? Huh? Trick load of kids. Maybe, I can't speak on the black culture. Maybe Shame. he thinks that's actually kids. Correct. That's maybe, true. That's correct. That's why, thinks, he's, that's why I'm in Maybe you. he loves kids Stuff and loves like love. You're so smart and strong and handsome. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine him wrapping around you. Oh, and taking just a you. heated blanket, like an electric blanket. I you would guys. just love if you, if we were on the couch and you were in between my legs with your rested back on my chest. <laughs> you like wouldn't be able to see. Yeah, <laughs> that'd be I good. Do that thing with my dick where it goes poop, poop, and kind of hits your back. <laughs> <laughs> Remember? That'd yeah. be funny. Yeah, you know, I'd ride how, you. Imagine how much Fucking heat you guys checks. generate. I love uh, we'd be hot. I would get the blanket off, dude. Seriously, <laughs> <laughs> it must be so weird for gay dudes. Like, there's no way they're not laughing when something like that happens. What when they both get like steamy? when they're both all like kind of how dude get the blanket off, yeah, I'm dude. Hot. What the fuck? <laughs> True. It's, it's like kind of funny, honestly. It's yeah. hilarious. It's got to be, dude. I mean, what do you think our first fight would be? Ooh. Somewhere to eat. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you guys both, Why? You guys both love cases. We would just SO us. Yeah, dude. You guys would never fight about food. Everything you eat yeah, is like, yeah, delicious. Every yeah. single dude, I, before this, I had a Ziploc bag of his rice and ground beef. And yeah. I was like, this is so good. Yeah, My dude. turbo fuel. The only yeah. thing I can cook is different types of grains. <laughs> Ch- ground beef or chicken well you'd be in the kitchen in our relationship yeah. i'm not much of a cook i'll pay, don't worry i'll pay for it <laughs> uh, <laughs> always does i'll make you dance boy. He's always doing this crap to me. oh you riding you're such a butch <laughs> god damn don't say right i don't know shane's more of a stud huh i say you're no. a butch shane's a stud don't take my butch card look at, that. Bro. Look at him this is chill He's a fucking. I'm a slob. He's a butch. He looks like he's butch. about to ref a, a girls' basketball league. <laughs> <laughs> Are you a butcher or a stud? Me? Yeah. I think I'm more of a lipstick lesbian myself. What? Yeah. yeah. I'd say. <laughs> Give me a manicure. You're kind of a glam. Lesbian. Dress me up a little bit. True. Yeah, you'd fill out a suit. Make me the girl I always wanted to be. Damn, if we got married pulsed. though, who would be wearing the suit? And who would be wearing the dress? I think we could both wear one, but I could wear more of a feminine one. You could have more of a masculine one. You'd wear like a Hillary Clinton. It. You'd wear more of like a Hillary Clinton. Yeah. yeah. Suit. You, yeah. You'd wear like a tuxedo with chucks. Yeah. <laughs> How? Oh, there's nothing worse. You wear a tuxedo, dude. I'm wearing sneakers to your wedding, by the way. Why? We all have. To. All the groomsmen are definitely wearing chucks. Just like wear cool fucking sneakers. Yeah, we're all going to dress oh, like Mumford no. and Sons. No way. Yes. No way. Bow ties. There's like a tweed suspenders. vest and something yeah. like oh. Jeff Cap. You you wear Jeff caps all the time. No, you you got to start no. bringing Jeff. You got to start wearing Jeff caps, dude. No, yo, you got to start wearing Jeff caps. Phil wears stage. Jeff caps. Yeah, he looks good in a Jeff. Is cap. he wearing frontwards or backwards? Frontwards. frontwards. He should Isn't Samuel it? L though. Samuel L a Jeff cap, dude. What's legends, that company called? Instant Tango? legend status. Ginty used to rock Jeff caps. <laughs> he did constantly. Yeah. <laughs> it's an aggressive. Move. Who's stumping? Frank, big old boy. Jesus, sounds hot. Shame. What would Frank think Sorry. about your guys' this whole setup? Or like, uh, he wouldn't ha- like it. He has a girlfriend. He wouldn't like us going at it. I think no. Frank's pretty open minded. I don't think he would. Frank care. would love it. I think so, but he Dude, really you get your double loads. dates would be awesome. He front loads his masculinity. What do you mean? What does that mean? Dang God. Wait, so Frank's going steady? It. Huh? Frank's going He's steady. A little steady Eddie, yeah. Me? I'm Billy No Mates. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Bigly. Why? Huh? Why are you MGTOW? I'm not MGTOW, but there's no girls at trash dumps. So I'm not meeting them. Dude, right now. there's the internet. I'm not going on fucking Hinge and Bumble. Christian singles, dude. No. <laughs> Christian singles. Why not? <laughs> I'm just, I don't. Now that I only watch spirituality YouTube, Get all my Christian ads singles. are just Christian singles. I don't, I don't participate. Don't farmers, don't farmers meet. No, Come on, dude. I mean, dude, when the universe wants me to have a girlfriend, I'll get one. Mm. I don't have to have some technocrat 
swipe over some girl that I need. I don't need that. Mm. Doesn't really vibe. What are you anymore. doing to to work to get a woman? Shane, I'm working on myself. <laughs> That's well, all you, you got to do. I'm working on myself. Work? I'm working on my house. That's all you got to do. True. They you know, do you know off the come. notebook. Huh? You know off the notebook. Never saw the notebook. Kind of guy you did. <laughs> 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 Let's go home. <laughs> I never kept my, I never stayed awake for it. Yeah. I always like True. Phone and stuff. You were always cum drained. You were always like hand jobs and stuff. Yeah, it, probably. dude. I was probably fingering during half of it, so I don't remember. But I do remember the guy was doing the same thing. You, you're living the notebook, bro. True. I? I watched it. True. Oh, okay. When it rains, you got on your deck and you're like, <laughs> I think that's her name. No, nah, the Notebook's a fucked up movie. It's about a guy who builds a house for a girl who just was like fucking some other guy, and then she was like, "Yeah, I gotta live here." That's kind of gay. Yeah, pretty lame. Obviously, chicks like that though. They like the idea they of a man dedicating chaos. their entire life to them, even though they're yeah fucking they rich. It was fuck. like a, she left him for like a rich guy, yeah. and you wonder why they she didn't crawls back to his hard work and he makes love to her in a candlelit like Sam. half built house. Absolute simp. The whole yeah. time she's just like, I'm gonna put this there, and it just no yeah. concept. And isn't one of them like wounded from World War Two? Am I thinking the right movie? I don't know. I don't know. Is it that um, Fault in Our Stars or whatever is good? The lady what? with the nose tube. Pearl Harbor is the Notebook. <laughs> you ever see Pearl Harbor? No. It's the same thing. Is it the Notebook? Really? Yeah. He was. There's a girl. She was dating Ben Affleck. His plane goes down, so everybody thinks he's dead, and his best friend starts fucking his lady, yep. and he comes back. Yep. And just in time for Pearl Harbor. And then Pearl Harbor happens. Then him and the boy team up. They're like, I, I'm going to forgive you for fucking my lady when everybody thought I was dead. We got to kill these goddamn nips. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> these fucking nips. Your Dr. Seuss got canceled? <clears throat> Dr. Seuss did? Yeah, man. For what? They, they busted up some of his old drawings. He he was drawing a... Uh, you know how he draws like everyone a little yeah. silly? Well, he, drew, he took his hand... He, he took his... I got uh, it. Tried drawing some Asians. <laughs> Yeah, and he also yeah, drew some black. Asian he drew some, hate right nah, now. he blew some. He drew some black fellers and did like the old, like red lip, black face stuff. <laughs> He's but, a goofy drawer. <laughs> I'd have to see the. Con- I'd have to see the context. I don't know if he was trying to speak out against it. I mean, probably not. How old? Is, like, when was Doctor Seuss like kicking around? Like, when did know. he start? When did Doctor start doing his thing? Oh boy! Yeah, the, the black. Th- I was like, what My did they get him for? <laughs> Are those apes? They got him on a pretty rough one. <laughs> What's that? Dr. Seuss is making some rowdy I cartoons. I didn't even see those ones. Rough drafts. Rough drafts. Yeah, I didn't see that it's one. It's probably just easier not to shade in the lips like that. Yeah, he was doing like straight up like... A little swat stick action? Not yeah, I mean... I there's any swaz. Was there any swaz in there? Yeah, but it looked like a political cartoon. In Dr. Seuss's defense, literally everybody that's ever drawn tosses in a swastika. Yeah, true. As as soon as, that's one of the funnest things. If you know, start yeah. doodling... Yeah, and it's an Indian peace sign. True. The Hindu, oh. Yeah, the Hindu. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But yeah, also I, with your girl stuff, I don't think they had it that bad. What with do you like mean? not being able to vote till nineteen twelve. Also, never had to go out and hunt for all those years. They were cave women. Yeah, hunter gatherers. Yeah, but everyone's like they get bopped. Titty. Yeah, but they get bopped on the head. Dude, you could also, every now and then, <laughs> yeah, dudes were getting eaten by saber tooths. They had to give titty. True. And then wait for stuff to come, skin them, and make cool furs. Get raped. And they couldn't vote. Like, they kind of had a good deal their whole entire lives. And then someone fucked it up for them. Yeah. Yeah. And in men's defense, men true. couldn't vote either until. True. Yeah. Most men. Ever. True. Men still can't vote. That's fair. That's fair. You yeah. can on, though. Like, when are we going to start and stop recording history? I like that. Yeah. Heard yeah. That. But yeah, I think that, you know, I think women. Also, I know what you're trying to do. <laughs> and no. That's I think they had a I tough feel. time, though, because then you could trade them and, like, rape them. If you were a dad. We and, can beat them up. True. This is true. We definitely can. And we still can. And we always will be able to beat them up. We'll always be able to beat the hell out of them. It's yeah. got to tick them off, dude. Has to. Imagine if your whole entire life, like, that's what I was just thinking about, uh, like, the role reversal. Yeah, like the way you're talking about, the way you feel around me. When you're around someone who's obviously yeah. stronger than you, you got to start, like, Well, not necessarily and, stronger, but definitely more cunning and conniving. True. Right? Way more cunning and conniving. Definitely more ripped. Definitely, especially this summer. Summer, dude, 2021 at the pool. Wow, it turns out 21 might be Matt Summer, dude. <laughs> <laughs> He's shredded. Damn. JD Ball. I'll give you that. Always will be. <laughs> Always will be. What are you talking about? You can, I'll dude, give you, you Jamie. run a mile the Jamie fastest football. in the world. You had a bad fucking Calm attitude. Yourself. You had a bad Calm fucking yourself. attitude. The coach Calm didn't yourself. like it. Whoa, you had a bad attitude, attitude in football? Attitude. That's a pretty good attitude. That's bad, attitude. <laughs> That's pretty bad attitude. The coach didn't even, they couldn't even put him in. Coach what? didn't even know his name. 
JV ball. Uh, okay, you can, you can probably run a mile fast <laughs> as shit. You up. could kill the presidential challenge. You're JV ball. I'm varsity, dude. Bro, no I, big deal. Here's what I'm kind of. I'm the kind of dude who can sees have the, the whole JV varsity complex and goes, "That's a higher hell with it, bro." And then crushes the guy, the the football coach's top dog in wrestling and gym class, dude. I mean, dude, he tech had a fall, fake dude. Hand. He had a fake hand. Tech fall. No, no, no. The, yes, he did. Whoa, no. you left that out. No, no, no. Yes, he I did. Beat, you, you, you're getting your wires crossed. I beat the you didn't. the freshman gym teacher in sumo wrestling. That's the guy who has a fucked up hand. Yeah. I'm talking about the coach. He was, if, if I don't know you if you were there at the time, the head football coach. I know. You know what I'm talking Before about? Before I was there, yeah. The head football coach <laughs> was a gym teacher. Said he had a motor on you. You do. You have a motor. He had one of it. He had you. his top dog. <clears throat> we're on the gridiron together. He goes, come on. We're, you you got to show him how we do this. Yeah. Tech fault him, bro. 16-0. What is it, dude? Good job. What are you going to talk about? <laughs> huh? What are you going to talk about? Stay champ. Please. Of De- just, State champion of Delaware. Of that's Delaware. That's There's four teams. JV ball. There's four teams. That's State champion of Delaware. And you're only JV, dude. Don't dude. don't come to me with the I'm whole. a wrestler, dude. You're I'm not. A wrestler, you're not. Dude. I'm a wrestler. Video proof, you're not. I'm no V. What are you talking about, dude? There's weight classes in wrestling, huh? you psycho. <laughs> you can't just go and try- wrestle someone your own size, huh? I'm not wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting hip wrestle Noah. in the kitchen. Huh? Wrestle I Noah. would never do it. Noah's a wrestler. Who Gardini was actually a wrestler. So was, yeah, Gardini so was looks Noah. like a wrestler. Well, Gardini was actually a legit wrestler. He was wrestler. nasty little wrestler. Yeah. Yeah, a little WAP wrestler. That's the last True, thing coming at you. Rape, that's rape. Yeah. But WAP learns how to wrestle, that's over, dude. six to 12 rapes. Yeah. It's a good baker's dozen. <laughs> last thing we need to do is teach Italians Yeah, combat. Bill, you got to wrestle someone in it's, your weight class. Yeah, yeah, I would never go wrestle. I understand like, it, but you say this stuff about the pools and like you're going to be the... Just, I'm going to be shredded. Mom's yeah, going to notice what I'm, I'm weight shredded. class. What I'm, I'm saying... Mom's going to say I'm shredded. Do you think you're yeah. going to have abs by the summer 21? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. You say it's gay, dude. It's gay to have all that extra stuff on you. Bro. Do you like treats? Do you like your sour cream? Our guest. You want your sour cream? Well, hold on. Creamy? Take oh. it easy, bud. Because <laughs> I like this. treats. He says this. What's scare? Eating sweet treats or looking in the mirror like? Like a Greek, dude? Oh. Like an Adonis, dude? I'm looking like better. In- the Greeks were I'm pretty gay. better. I just live for strength. Right. Front load me. For what, dude? Huh? For what? Battle. <laughs> the arena. <laughs> for what? The arena. Dude, it's about aesthetics. Road dude. rage. It's about proportion If it were to ever happen. Aesthetics? Aesthetics is chick talk. Yeah, literally. Nah, aesthetics, literally gay. aesthetics. Chick Being talk. addicted to sweets and like I'm not, I don't crappy eat sweets. food. Gay. I don't eat crappy food. Yes, you just. I just watched you eat a fucking quesadilla. Dilla, chicken and cheese, dude. No big deal. You eat dairy, huh? You drink another animal's breast milk. Dude? Gay. It's lame. <laughs> nah, that's gay. You got whole milk, milk is alpha as yeah. fuck. No, it's not. High taste. You got tricked by a fucking industry that sells you an inflammatory food. You are gluten free. That's fake. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Autoimmune diseases are fake. <laughs> it's so fake. We'll see. We'll Shame. see. I'm not jumping in, dude. <laughs> Although you did attack my people yeah. with the sweet treats. <laughs> I'll, I'll ignore it. Hey, abs, look, abs are as gay as it gets. I, abs are, are, so abs are literally here, as gay as it gets. You know, if, you're, if you're a grown man with abs, yeah. you you're going, have a mental disorder. There's something wrong. Okay. Something's going on. Because to obtain <laughs> that type of physique, the amount of shit you have to put yourself you in. You don't. You just have to stop eating crap. No, dude. You just have to cut the no. crap. You, it's true. No, it is. You have to just de-addict yourself from the crap diet you've been brainwashed into. Brother. And just let it go. For you to get absolutely shredded, you would have to take some sort of testosterone. No, you don't. Way. Absolutely don't. All you have to or do is you're just going to look. Wait, are you accusing Matt of being on roids? I'm not accusing him, but he has <laughs> done That's before. That's the ultimate compliment. He has done before. You guys have been brainwashed. Wait, by he's done what? Roids? Industry. Yeah. No, I didn't. You're a ruiner. I took things that would totally, <laughs> a ruiner. I took totally legal <laughs> supplements from GNC that would supposedly boost your testosterone that are subsequently banned now hmm. by Can, the FDA. Couldn't do it just willpower? I was going for gains like you, dude. I was a, I was fooled. Yeah, you were. Was, what's that stuff down there? Hold on. You want to talk about pre-workout? <laughs> yes, yes. What about, about pre-work? pre-workout? Dude, this guy used to drink gallons of fucking Jack 3D pre-workout. Yeah. What's the difference? Dude, I was getting fucking wired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and when you got that big jug of whey isolate, whey isolate, nothing wrong with that. Dude, it's fucking gay. I just up why do you want protein, protein powder? Muscle recovery. My tits are sore from fucking doing decline bench, one ten yeah. dumbbells. Your arms would snap if you touched them. Yeah, dude. I'm sore, and then yeah, I did the right. fifty push-ups, so I need a little something extra. What are you trying to do? Why, what are you going so hard against? You're saying I'm, I'm not going hard. This is where me. I'm at. You're projecting on me, dude. I'm not projecting. You have to be a psycho to get. Don't look to me. What psycho? What's I'm not stepping with brothers. Well and going to the gym like no, no. I'm saying trying to lift as much weight as human possible. I want to do this too. What are you running from, dude? Huh? What are you running from, brother? I'm in my house. What are you running from? Habs are good. What's wrong? Why is it though? 
It, they're just gay for a grown man. No, it's not. For a grown man, like, oh, my ass it's are It's gay to be in. pudgy and be like, I can't control my diet. <laughs> this is 100% USDA, my and friend. And my thing is, I don't care what people do. I'm like, hey, man, do you. Yeah. That's when you know they're the one projecting, when you have a problem with somebody else's behavior. Oh, I don't. I'm just saying. What am I triggering within you? want to obtain that. It's kind of gay. I just want to be healthy, dude. I Shed know. the bull crap. But just if I just so happen to people get with like fucking up, crazy abs aren't always the healthiest. Usually that's, not that's doing true. too hot. Now you're doing chick logic. When you now we're having out. different arguments. No, this is Bill logic. That's just you definitely be wearing the dress, dude, at the no. fucking wedding. <laughs> no, Bill, I support what you're doing. It's just yeah. a shame you won't support me back. You know, you have to try to. Tear I do me down. support you back, but then I've already claimed summer 2021. Then you go say some crazy <laughs> shit. Like I, that. I I will. I his, claimed summer 2021 in March. I'm not saying it's in Matt's defense, I claimed it was. It could be Matt Summer I, 21, I and that's what started people the battle. Tell, that's how you know it's for summer when other people are saying it's Matt did summer. say being pudgy was gay, and I, you know, <laughs> I'm not going to get involved and start swinging because then it's two against one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to let this play out. I would love to get fat. Well, no, you wouldn't. I wore weird nah, vest. it's not all it's cracked up. I wore a weird vest last episode. Everyone's like, oh, my God, Billy got fat. I'm not fat. Right? I mean, dude, I, I think... No, you you're do, not very fat. Me, I think you should do whatever you want. <laughs> I think you should do whatever you want. I want. I really want to start working on being in a ma- more masculine space. Yeah. Almost like a ludist. More masculine right than working at like a dumpster company? Yes. Pretty mass space. That's pretty... That is a masculine space. What do you think? What do you think is more masculine? You should join the military. Woody's... <laughs> 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 yeah, no, that does stoke the iron. Hooters Kitchen. Ooh, I don't most, know. I don't know. No, nah, that might be the most masculine. You think that's space. kind of just every all the food cooked that's at Hooters? Just, is you're an absolute club. orbiter. It's like strippers' boyfriends. Strippers' boyfriends by day just cook at Hooters. You yeah. are an orbiter. You're right. You are just orbiting yeah. the sniz, hoping to get some. But if you went in there with masculine energy, you'd be a strip club DJ at that point. I don't sure. think you'd be a cook at Hooters. Josh. If you're orbiting at Hooters, or that's low, dude. Nah. Like, oh, she's my best friend, brother. Yeah, that's like <laughs> my <laughs> sister to me. God. That's like my sister. Think how much they like shit talk every Hooters waitress's boyfriend. Like, oh, he's such a dick. He's, oh, yeah. He doesn't understand her at all. Yeah, you're just Not in a weedest video. It's just anyway, I do there, think right? the summer is probably yours. I look at, you know. I'm just going to be. Shredded. I'm not done with this fight yet. I'm going to be shredded. <laughs> I'm going to be shredded, and it's going to be everyone. Summer. I will say this. I'm just saying I'm going to be shredded. I'm dried out. I will say this. <laughs> abs. Bill has a point. Abs. I have always agreed that abs were gay. Mm. And it sounds like a fat coat, but it's not. It does sound like a fat coat. What's a fat coat? Being fat. Cope. cope. Oh, a fat coat. Being like yeah. not being able to get abs and being like, Psh, abs are fucking gay. I'm saying if you cut the junk out of your diet and you so happen to get so shredded that you had to have abs, nobody will be like, I got to get rid of these. You're like, this rules. Yeah. I hear you. But I mean, we are notorious mm. fish pods. For you to become nah, some dude, sort I was of Greek ripped, guy. I was ripped in fucking high school, bro. Speak dude, for yourself. That was like 20 years ago. I'm about, to, I'm about to bring it back. You bring it sexy back. Yeah, dude. I got ripped. I got grounded in high school and just stopped eating and just did workouts down my basement and got fucking ripped. I, got, I, used, to, I used to get grounded for a month at a time when I got caught drinking. You, you went on a hunger strike. I would go down the basement. I would do pull-ups on my metal beams, and I just got fucking ripped. It ruled. It yeah, and were you jealous then? I think nah. so. I think a little bit. I think this is coming up a little bit now. The whole time, they were always just trying to beat on me to do all this stuff. Oh, so that's what this is about. No, mm-hmm. not at all. Yeah. <laughs> obviously Damn, if you guys dude. beat him up his whole life obviously he's gonna get yoked true protect yourself unrapeable no one ever did that for the you. most part <laughs> for the most part yeah there could be you there's always a bigger fish Jocko yeah, could get that's you that's why we have guns Jocko could get you <laughs> no Jocko's Jocko could fraud, rape the dude. fuck come on he's Jocko fraud. would wail on you Jocko I understand he's with his fucking jujitsu and stuff but I mean like he would wail he, on he you. reeks you. of a fraud with, I, obviously he was a fucking Navy SEAL and everything obviously and you respect but that for them to put him out there like that when he got the real SEALs guys the like real Je- SEALs guy like Jesse Ventura throwback <laughs> True. computer illiterate that's a man <laughs> you think Jocko is a fraud I just think like the whole you put on you tell me he couldn't rape you huh you only Jocko could rape you no he probably could but I'm just saying like <laughs> He's just like I, I don't buy into the whole Jocko shit. All I think good, I, I'll like, say this right, with Jocko: it's probably the same as like people looking at Neil deGrasse Tyson as like, yeah, that's an Why astronomer. He get to be the guy? He's goat. an astronomer. And it's like, no, he's not. The goat astronomer is not doing fucking serious XM. True, and he's not. He's trying to be famous. Women. Yeah. Well, 
Neil deGrasse's stuff. He was, was grabbing bull- arms. That was bullshit. <laughs> he was bro. grabbing arms. He did dude. like a uh, fucking like Jedi handshake. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. He that got was fucked. just aggressive nerd. He yeah. got fucked. <laughs> Obviously. Yeah. I, I think deGrasse Damn. kind of passed through that though. I don't think it really messed him up. No, nah, I don't think so at all. No, he kept it rolling. He had a show on Compound, dude. He had a show on Kumia's network. Did he really? <laughs> yeah. What was it? Fucking talking science. Talking space and pussy. Yeah. Talking about space on, a, on Compound. That's so funny. Yeah. Just interviewing him. I'm glad you guys sorted that out. So, yeah, I mean, uh, dude, I'm, you know, I'm rooting for everybody, dude. I hear you. When I, when it sounded I get, like there was a little bit eh. of vitriol and pride in that. Yeah, if you ask me, if you ask me. Toy, that's just toying, dude. Now, it sounded like there was... It sounded like... That's having fun. That's just having fun. like there's a little <laughs> bit of vitriol. Like, that's, I'm just going like this. I'm at, like, level, like, probably, like, 500, where it's, like, above courage, probably, like, more, like... Where's pride? Peace. Pride is right before... Anger. No, prize. Yeah, right before anger. Then what? Anger. What level? Anger, right what level do you announce where you're at, and then deny that it's prideful? Uh, if I you announce say, it into a microphone, where would you say pride lies? I see where, I see where you're going with this, <laughs> Kensington. I see. I see I, I'm trying to. I'm trying to look down from the thing, being like, I'm, I'm, yeah, he I'm, can't I'm, grasp I'm, I'm this. I'm getting some anger. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm getting some anger. I've surrendered <laughs> anger. I don't even remember what that feels like. No anger. I couldn't care less. Uh, bit of it. Maybe you're facing. Total indifference. No. And mistaking it for anger. <laughs> you're, talk, you're talking about apathy? That's level like 40 on the consciousness. Tom scale. did the same stuff, though. What are you talking about? Tom got all far. He, when I, he came home, mm-hmm. and I was in freshman year, eighth grade, wherever the fuck it was. Yeah. Went to Dick's Sporting Goods, bought a whole weight <laughs> says like, I'm going to get cock diesel. We yeah. played Wu-Tang Shaolin style on game PlayStation rules. 1. Yep. Push-ups after every loss. Yeah. He's like, I will fight you. Yeah. That went away. Then he got into getting in shape again, started doing the stupid ass fucking Muay Thai shit mm-hmm. with you. And he's like, I'm going to fight you again. Didn't do it with me. Yeah, you guys did it together in West Philly. No, we did not, dude. You didn't do Muay Thai kickboxing? You, you're a liar. I did that somewhere else. I did in New Jersey. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you both did Muay Thai. And you're a liar. Every- we did jujitsu. When I was doing jujitsu, bro, I was 157 oh, pounds. God. He couldn't contain me, dude. That'd Man. be tough. He couldn't contain me. Bill, that's true. How long ago? Start years and years ago. Couldn't contain. Damn, you did jujitsu long ago. No, pretty tight. For how long? How long was that? I only did it for six months, and I was a problem, bro. <laughs> I was a fucking problem. <laughs> I remember we're outside near the clothesline, and you were like, "What the fuck?" You were, you were so confused. But oh, you know, man, that's another. That's another time. He pretzled you. He was tying Dude, you up. He was, I was having fun. You bent man. him to I was, your will. I was a, just a little thing. I was 157 pounds. I wasn't fighting. You're shit, a scrappy dude. guy. It is what it is. But to answer your question, Shane, it's like, yeah, I just you know, people bring these kind of things to me. I go. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's what they're doing. Go, <laughs> let me just have fun. Yeah, just, just in a spirit of peace and harmony. Let me just have fun. I know we all love each other. Yeah, true. But you're saying that I'm right now doing a thing. You're talking. Tom did this where he got in shape and said, "You get in shape, up. you get all <laughs> you fucking get riled shape. up." <laughs> and yeah. like, I can fuck you up. And then, you know, I wasn't saying I want to fight you. I would never I, do. That. I understand that, but you carry yourself. You're like, living in the past, bro. I'm not living in the past. You I just brought up be beating me up. What are you talking about? Ten years ago. What are you talking about? Did you just bring me up? You were, like, you were talking about saying how people yeah. try to do jujitsu. I'm saying that. You're, Billy, you're saying people do these. You call me a pussy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the hell, Billy, dude? Billy, here, this is what I'm picking up. Wall. I'm just having fun, this dude. This is what I'm <laughs> picking up. I'm picking <laughs> up you going like people try them uh, jujitsu things and they try to Whoa. bring a second accent. What's this? They try to do them jujitsus on me. <laughs> oh, you like, did jujitsu for like three weeks. Six months. You and stunk. I was a problem, dude. <laughs> you, were, you were confused, dude. I don't even remember. I remember, dude. I mean, you were just like eh, trying to do all these like oxish moves, like, and I was like just all technique and it's folding you up. Like, Come on, get, I was like this, get up, brother, and pulling you up. And you should like, make a script out of that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man. I mean, you're living in the past, bro. You're talking about ten years ago. You're just like, you're like oh, twenty years ago, Tom did this thing. He's like, dude, what are you talking about? You just talked about beating me up ten years ago. <laughs> I was talking about that because you brought up Tom, so I'm like, I'll travel the past uh, with this guy. Okay. I guess I'll go back to the past with him. But uh, well, I try to stay in the present. I mean, I hope you break my twenty or 2009 PRs. What PRs? In the gym. Why has it got to be a competition? <laughs> with you, dude? Why can't we all be great together at our own things? We can be, but don't be sure credit. Summer 2021. I can't help it. Leave Shane it alone. claimed it. Leave her alone. Me. I didn't even. I didn't you, even... Can get, you can have the fall. The fall might be mine, dude. Leave her alone, though. Don't <laughs> touch Here's the thing, dude. When we're at the pool... Mommy's gonna. It's gonna say, be no choice. Mommy's gonna be like, "Wow, Matt, you're really in shape right now." Mommy's gonna say something about that. And that might make the summer of 2021 mine. I think all I live for is truthfully. I think if Matt carries on this trajectory, yeah, of getting shredded, yeah, like like really shredded, yeah, 
<laughs> I think if I'm there for the Fourth of July party, if I'm there, if I can fit you guys into my fucking schedule, <laughs> right. you guys worry about working out. Fourth of July last worry, year dude. was fucking lit. I'm worried about getting paper. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> All right. Right, right, I'm like a hybrid of both of them. <laughs> True. <laughs> <laughs> but if I if I can schedule it in, see if I can get down there. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'd like to witness it because it's not up to you. You can claim That's summer twenty one. But it's not up to you. In the end, it is up to your guy's mom to see who she compliments their physique first. True. That's all And I, I think if you get in the pool, Matt has abs. If Matt has abs, it's summer 21. Even my mom might call me gay, though. So Everybody will call so you gay. So we're going to have to come to the pool with racks. We have to bring all the money you have. Yes. So you got to bring all your racks and you just have to fucking just Floyd Mayweather at the pool for mommy, dude. <laughs> like, mommy, I'm so in shape and I have so much money for you. Yeah, and then she'll decide who summer it is. The, we the weird disadvantage we all had growing up, though, was all that shit was gay. Like, mean? like the football stuff. Like, I remember you were talking like, oh, yeah, like your uncles, your dad. Like, yeah, oh, get the gym. Like, if I went to the gym with my cousin, like, okay, Hans and Franz, what are you doing at the YMCA, yeah. you fags? Yeah. Yeah, but you're my one, for my cousin, you. my cousin, my one uncle, the kid who he ended up playing at Notre Dame. He was like a five star recruit. He was like top 20 in the country. Yeah. His dad was on his ass every day about working out. I went really? to school with the kid, yeah. Troy Reader. He played, Who's that? Uh, Who linebacker. You? Never heard of him. Yeah, he plays in the NFL. And that other kid, uh, Brian O'Neill. He's O'Neal? Big, he's a big boy. He's a yeah. player. Mooney. Mm. Who? Mooney? Isn't that his Mooney, name? Evan. Mulrooney. Mulrooney. Yeah, yeah, yeah monster. Yeah. Go. He played yeah. Maryland D1 ball. Although, uh, didn't I hear he's getting into improv now? No, no. he's he's That's on, abs. He's getting on a Michael Improv Peter. is abs. He, yeah, dude. He, he is trying to get into uh, acting. Abs. Very big abs. I'll tell him to his face he's gay because now he weighs as much as me. Does he really? I might have, yeah, dude. He just won. Nah, fucking, he's got that D1 strength in dude, him. Dude, he just won. O lineman. O lineman of the decade, Shane. What? Where? For Delaware. Wow. Yeah, he just called me and told me that. <laughs> well, I, I thought he went to Maryland. He, he high transferred. School. High school. Oh, wow. O lineman of the decade, yeah. Damn. Very funny. What? Yes. Damn. Dude, they do that by the decade? Uh, yeah, I was like, I mean, how when, was it, that? when it's he's Delaware, like, when there's just 20 me. kids. True. <laughs> Still Damn, decade, Pennsylvania the decades. Like no, no, no. Win a line of the decade. Probably not, but <laughs> I mean, you could, Delaware. You, I would, I could make a run. You'd have been a motherfucker in Delaware, ball, dude. Please, like every other guy. Let's all start building each other up. For the I look like every place. other guy now, dude. Yeah, because yeah, I, I focus on other things. Oh, I say we build. Each, <laughs> I, focus I, say on, we, I focus on getting Molly. on Saturday Night Live. I say we build each other up, dude. <laughs> I say we build each other up. That could be good. I mean, it was, it was. We were sailing. No fucking murky waters, then you know, it just starts rippling out a little bit. We talking about that's just guys having fun. This is guys having fun. True. Guys have had fun. Had a good time. You guys got some issues. Nah, you guys need to work out. It's all you stayed fun. quiet. I don't remember that. Me? You stayed quiet. You I stayed quiet on what? Trying to elevate this house, and you stayed uh, quiet. No. Uh, Billy wanted you on his side. No, Billy wanted me to jump in. And I can't do that. I can't. You could, do you think I'm gonna fucking? Remember, this is a fun thing. You can't two on one a guy at the True. table, dude. Psh, used to it, dude. Look, you see where my back is? It's a corner. Been against the wall, dude. Yeah. Come on, man. Nothing. Are Nothing. you begging me to jump in? Yeah, it'd be great. <laughs> no. It's <laughs> fun. We're guys having no. fun. <laughs> no, I support, I, support, I support your endeavors. I think it's good. I think getting shredded is tight. Yeah, it's going to be sick. But if you get abs, you do have to recognize they're gay. That's the only, that's the downside of it. That's what you want to call them, dude. They'll be gay. <laughs> I'm sure we could find you on record saying abs are gay. Probably. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Every butterfly was a fucking larva at some point, dude. <laughs> I'm in the present, bro. Yeah. I'm in the present. Would you consider that blooming? Big Having time. abs? Big time, dude. Would you be like mission accomplished? No, I don't I genuinely don't care really if I have them. Yeah, but I'm going I to. It, I genuinely don't care, but I if you have them, a lot. it rules. They're tight. I can't even imagine. If you don't have them, I remember you talking whatever. about having the desire to walk around shirtless. I definitely have the desire to walk walk around shirtless. Yeah. I was in the pool. I went to uh Swim class. How are you matching up? Oh, shirtless, bro. Bro, wasn't even a fucking thing, dude. Are you kidding? Really? It's crazy. Dude. I bet the other dads were mad. Probably pissed. I think they were pissed. I also have the "Don't tread on me" tattoo. You front was kind of masculinely hard. Yeah, I mean, dude, that's uh, I was in the pool and I, you know, I was, I was like, damn, dude, all the hard work's paid off. I got to stun on all these dads yeah. in swim class. Yeah. Fucking sick. That's what it's all about. <laughs> You're just trying to be a scary dad. When it's not a competition, bro. It's just a, I'm a beacon. I'm like, God, brothers, brothers, get like me. Come on, brothers. Yeah. What's going on? Maybe. It's just about excellence. Your light on the hill, dude. It's all about excellence. The dude. city on the hill. Isn't that how that goes? I think the light's yeah. at the end of the tunnel, though. Lights at the bills. end of the tunnel, too, dude. It's on the if, hill. If Texas opens this stuff up. Oh, yeah. 
And there's nothing going on there. We'll all, we'll all have abs if Texas Kenny, opens back up. Come here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I would I would hog tie that man. You if given the opportunity, yes. You would kidnap the governor? Not, kid- <laughs> not, a governor. <laughs> not a governor. Okay. Mayor Kenny. He's just such a fraud, dude. Yeah, like any good vigilante dude, you probably do have problems with the mayor. I mean, Batman. he's a fraud. Yeah, well, dude, a lot of these guys have kind of larger political aspirations. So right now, they're just kind of like shitting themselves. Yeah, Kenny was a <laughs> bitch when he did the thing. He's a pussy. When Kenny did the uh, the Rizzo one? statue, mm. I don't remember. He took that down in the middle of the night. Pussy. Yeah, yes. that's kind of that was kind of puss. When he did the COVID thing, the, the Zoom, I was like, this guy. He sucks, dude. That sucked. He's like, well, nah. it's just like, didn't Newsom out in LA just like went to the French Laundry? He's doing a lot of weird. No, he, no, he's, he's doing created other... like a law of like your company has to have X amount of people of color. Yeah, on the well, board. He's, he's on the. He's got hot coals under his feet. Yeah, he's he got also caught up at, at for a um, restaurant getting kicked out. Yeah, so he's like, he just commented on the governor of Texas like announcing that, saying absolutely reckless. It's like, dude, well, there's, why not, don't you there's just not a shut big difference. Be, there's not a big difference between Texas and California in terms of the uh, case rates and deaths. Yeah, that was, a, that was a big kind of problem. Yeah, dude. The chick from South Dakota just talked at CPAC. Probably didn't watch it. I did. Like, uh, I but, did watch CPAC. Dude, that chick rules. I, wa- I didn't watch it. I watched Trump's speech. That's oh, it. the chick from South Dakota never shut the fuck down, dude. Fauci told her she was going to have 10,000 people in the um, emergency rooms. Guess how many she had at its peak? How many? 600. That's a lot. Bro? <laughs> For South Dakota? That's a lot. <laughs> you want to tell me? This stuff's at least still here. I mean. Yeah. I mean, you lived, you fuck. lived with it. There's nothing. What? You lived with it. Lived with what? COVID-19. COVID-19. 19, bro. The thing they're calling COVID-19? Yeah, yeah sure. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think it is? Dude, my cousin had it. He was on his Oculus headset. I saw him touching the handles, and I just smiled. I said, Frank, let me try that. Put it on my head. Fucked with the Oculus. Never got sick. Probably spread it to like four people. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, no, it's true. 80% of people don't experience any symptoms. And I think like... 99% of people who get it are in no danger of hospitalization. So what's the deal? Hey, man, you tell me that's where the question is. A lot where, of that's, Chinese money coming in here. I know that. Yeah. What about yeah, that? Yeah, I agree. I agree. The whole thing was a yeah, little. Yeah, it, it was. You know, it was overblown and it was politicized. Yeah. Exactly. Politicized out the ass. At this point, it's like, dude, just give us summer 2021 because I'm going to snap. Yeah. They're giving you a lot summer of people, 21. Yeah, I but think Fauci's they are. saying like, oh, there's new, there's new mutations. Bro. The new mutations mm-hmm. are all things in la- fucking lab rats. Like, these aren't even fucking happening. Like, oh, we found a new mutation. Oh. And it's in lab rats. Let summer 2021 be yours, dude. No I'm one can trying. stop you. Shh. No Somebody one can, can stop you. I have to give him the Who? good word, though. Somebody can stop it from being his summer. Who? Who? <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> It could be our summer. Twenty twenty one could be our summer. Dude. Yeah, he's willing to share it. Just I'm willing to share him. the year. I want to share summer twenty twenty one. I'm just saying, everyone, all, those, all those smarty Mister Know It All redditors who want to hit you with the paragraphs, you're like, dude, just explain. Yeah, to me the Mister Writes. What the fuck's going? Mister Writes. There's yeah. there's people who think if I write a fucking ton of yeah. text, I'm right, and it's like it's yeah. like attack my occupation, but then True. completely brush over the fact that flu deaths are almost non-existent. Dude, they're like at like a thousand. Not even, dude. Really? Yes. I remember reading and it was so low because they say it's so low. They it's disgusting. Them, they project them to be like, in, you know, it's a projection, but they're like 60,000 60, deaths yes. a year. And it's like, damn, that many people die from the fucking flu. Oh, yeah. yeah. And then they're like, well, there's been like, I, th- I swear to God, I thought it was like low thousands, like like 1,200 Oh, deaths. a bunch of people fucking die. Well, they're saying they were saying that like there's this year there's been 1,200 and it's like, dude. but dude, once we take the masks off, you don't piss on me and call, tell, ready. tell me it's rain. Get ready, dude. Once they take the mask, you're you're talking about now. Wait till that flu comes back, dude. They don't even know about the fucking creator of the fucking PCR test. You can find anything if you cycle it enough. So what? The PCR test that they use. Yeah. If you cycle that enough times, you're gonna find a coronavirus in you. What? So if someone fucking dies, all you have to do is take a PCR test, like the fucking hospitals did. You die, you take the PCR test, cycle it a bunch of times. Oh, that's COVID. Give us 30 Gs. Damn. That's all you have to fucking do. And if they test positive for COVID, they don't run an autopsy. It's a COVID death. Dude, I just did, I did a show, Damn. this Fucked show up. that was taped. Watch No Agenda. That show is the fucking best for all this shit. Oh, you're talking about the guy at Rogan? Adam on. Curry. Damn. A beast. Rips through this shit. I just did a show, <laughs> a show that was taped. Yes. And uh, before it, we all had to get COVID tested. And there's a camera. He's like, do you mind if I film you getting tested? And I was like, no, fine. And this guy who's a doctor is like swabbing me. But it was one of those deep ones. Ah. And I, literally while he was doing it, I went. 
<laughs> literally just straight into his face and i was like holy like shit i was like Jurassic dude i'm Park. so sorry i'm so sorry and then he got the other nostril i immediately went <laughs> dude spit in this doctor's face twice and i was like i hope i test negative because i just that's directly a worker. yeah he just took it he didn't care at all he was like no it's fine it happens every time yep he did that to me i immediately spit in his face what the fuck on camera Obviously. And then looked at the camera, totally teary eyed, and I was like, "I hope I'm negative." <laughs> <laughs> hopefully, hopefully they filmed that. That would be, be fun. awesome. Yeah, that's good footage. God, that's hilarious. Yeah, that's how it should be done. That was nice. They had they just tested everybody. They tested the whole audience, everybody that was performing. We all, but we all sat together and waited. Yeah. To get the results, it's, which is logic kinda, is gone. Logic is gone at this point. Like, yeah. if you're still sitting here trying to champion it, like, oh, you don't understand. It's also, like, bro, we all tested negative. <laughs> Everybody in there tests negative. Yes, get out. Then they made us wear M95 masks yes. what the fuck? that are like super tight. You ever yeah. wear those? They like suck. Like the real, real deal ones. Yeah, the ones you put on yeah. over. Yes. Oh, they sucked. I was like, I'm not wearing it. And he kept yelling at me for being uh, – he kept chanting Florida every time I walked by because I was not wearing a mask. I was like, we literally everyone in this room just tested that. Yes. Can we it, knock it, it off? Is, it's the weirdest thing that they're trying but to do. But you have to do it for the cameras. Oh, There's like yeah. rules with yeah, like yeah. production – you say no. You should have cut a hole in your. I did say no. I didn't wear it. Wow. Really? I said I'm not going to wear that. Shane Ike. Bro, I said I'm not going to wear the mask. What are you going to not? How many people were in there? Uh, it was like 25. Yeah, man. Yeah. It's like go to the grocery store. Horse shit. I was and in again, we all tested a negative. I'm te- this shit's toast if Texas brings back the right numbers. Yeah. And if not, people have the DOS on whatever fucking governors are keeping this shit going. Because there's people that aren't from America that have a vested interest in seeing this go down. Yeah. Well, the problem is there's people who are so smart with statistics that they can like manipulate data. Yes, and you, can manip- be like, you can manipulate. Here you go, everything. and they put it out, and you're like, "There's I trust the data," and it's like you don't even understand how statistics work. Case numbers are down. They literally stopped cycling the PCR test as much as they were. There you go. Case yeah. numbers go down. It's fucking retarded. Yeah, it's over. It, it's not you know. It's there are dude. There are people who at just, this point people are just like, "Why are we even fighting anymore?" That's the, the new shit. Like, oh yeah, I'm just tired of it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like, I'm just excited. There are people weirdly who get fucking kind of how I feel rushed yeah. by it. I mean, I, I, I really don't. Yeah. I don't care about it. I'm glad you're heated. I mean, your family crushed it. Yeah. That it was fake. That was alarming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When the whole family walked through it, I was like. Well, there's it's... been people like weirdly. For some reason, like I've heard of two brothers-in-law who have like been like in their 40s, kind of healthy and just got fucking. Yeah, I told you the one. Yeah. I know another one yeah. who just got like totally wrecked by it. it was yeah. Like, you got to be careful because when you bring it up to people like I was when I was in Texas, I was talking to this bartender. And I figured he was anti-mask. Yeah. So I'm sitting there like hitting him with the fucking like, oh, I had it. It was fucking nothing. He was like, yeah, I got out of the hospital last month. I was in there for three months. There's a couple people that like, get oh, it and shit, they're dude. fucked. It's so yeah. bizarre. It's people bizarre. get sick all fucking but again, time. Yeah, it's one of I agree. Things. And that, yeah, was, that was why I kept doing shows. Yeah. I was like, well, I didn't well, stop doing shows yeah. when there were other That's what I'm sicknesses. saying with the fucking PCR test shit. If you're cycling it like crazy, everyone who gets fucking sick with every symptom on the fucking yeah. planet is like, dude, that was COVID. Yeah, no, I mean, dude, up if they didn't weird. blast that thing in the news, it would just be people were like, damn, oh, I shit. got the fuck. I got nailed with the yeah. fuck. It happened to me two years ago. I was like having heart palpitations and going to sleep at four o'clock. <laughs> yeah. It sucked. Yeah. yeah. Is that COVID? I don't know. No, nah, that's every though. day for me, baby. Woo. Woo. <laughs> heart palpitations, 4 a.m. <laughs> one in hat where all your money went. Yeah, also, if I do OD on Molly, delete that, strike that part from the episode. What? Have when it- I was talking about how you can't die from Molly. <laughs> That'd be a real Curb Your Enthusiasm clip. Bum, yeah. bum, 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 <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I think it'll be fine. I think that's the people who like start like greedily popping I mean, one after the other. Take Molly, you just no. got to make sure. <laughs> Doesn't that like sh- put you on shriv? My dong? Yeah. It shrivs your dong. Fuck that. Like, who cares, yeah. dude? I don't need to croon. Why? <laughs> the last thing I need is crooning. I thought you're here for the ladies. I just feel good. I'm always here for the ladies, bro. Come on. That's I'm saying you present and it's just like you got a shriv though. I'll tell you what you got to do. Down. And this is this is you guys you guys want to talk about getting ladies? Yeah. You got to come in with Lewis attitude, not Sam. Lewis, trust me? Never he only holds hands. Yeah. That's what you got to do. Yeah. Sam. Sam comes in with over the top. He's a killer. He's a a lady killer. You come in with Lewis attitude. They're like, what's up with that guy? And you say. You're talking about Sigma. (laughs) You're talking about Sigma males. What's that? Sigma male. There's alpha, beta, and then sigmas. right? No, true alpha is not here for the ladies. Huh? A true alpha? I'm not here for the ladies. I'm just just here to do my thing. And if ladies want to perform in the arena. I'm in the arena. Yeah. When you want ladies, you just grab their back, squeeze their face. Yes. 
and just so, go back to and God that Ring. that worked nine ninety nine percent of the time. That's that what worked. I was explaining to my friend. That guy was getting so much pussy that he started going like, "Oh, I can fuck anyone." Yeah. yeah. So it's like, "Hey, touch the small." Grab my pussy. That's what. That's Trump, also what governors what do. What Trump that. was saying. Yeah. In that. Yeah. Yeah. He was literally saying. When you have a billion dollars, you can walk up to women, you can grab them by the pussy, they don't care. Yeah. That's I what mean, he was saying. I didn't understand. That's the, how governors fuck. The too. hullabaloo. They, they, governors are at a masquerade ball and they touch the small of a, a lady's back. That's how they have sex. Yeah. Trump was uh, literally saying something everybody knew. Yeah. yeah. If you're a billionaire, you can walk up and grab a lady and they don't care. No, don't. That was the, that was the. <laughs> yeah. Like, no offense the, to guard dog, but like the dude's a fucking wop and he starts getting pussy, dude. Mom loves him. Cuomo. Yeah, the mom probably told me he's the most handsome boy on the planet. True. He thinks he can do whatever he wants. Guard dog, how are you and your mother's relationship? Guard dog's one We're of those mom hell ones. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's very good? No, it's just normal. Yes. Normal Italian normal or normal white normal? Normal white trash normal. All right. Yeah. But look at the melanin. Like, that's a real Italian. Cuomo's not a real Italian. <laughs> Wait. Oh, no. He's an original oh, geez, <laughs> I'm just saying. Jeez. He's an original Italian. You think? Yeah, Guido, baby. Yeah, you're saying he's from like northern Italy. He's northern. Yeah, he's from Milan. Genghis Khan had red hair. <laughs> what the fuck's that have to do with anything? I'm just saying. He's like, just talking he, about the white. He's greatness. a real Italian. Cuomo's not a real Italian. You think? You think the that his blood was mixed with? Who knows? People from the dark continent, and it no, ruined. No, 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 no. I, I have no idea. And that led to his bad behavior. Jeez, Bill. Some Middle East. Summer 2021 is about to be snatched from you, dude. Hey, you can take it from me, dude. <laughs> well, I'm just what saying, happened? He can take it from you now? No, no, no. I'm saying if you want to take it, I'll Come tell take you it. that Cuomo is the type of Italian that you're like, fuck, this dude's brutal. Yeah, I know what you're saying. And like, that's all it sounds paid. Imagine all the pussy bragging that dude has done. And the only reason this is happening yeah. is because he fucked with the Jays. He fucked with the Orthodox boys with their funerals and their True. fucking weddings. Immediately, this no, shit gets. No, it's not, dude. You're Matt, crazy, dude. You are crazy. He fucked with oh, them. Bill. They probably had Bill. this in a fucking sniper. Right Holy when he, he shut down that funeral, boom. Dude. Release the story. Go ahead. You're out no, of here. No, they fucking didn't. Dude, you no, know they powerful. fucking didn't, dude. You are such <laughs> the a Orthodox The Orthodox Jays. It, the yeah. one guy is on videotape like, I will do everything in my power to bring you down. I will use litigation, all my money. I will bring you down. <laughs> I didn't see that. Part. Yes, dude. They, claim, they, they put a fatwa on fucking Roma, <laughs> and they got it. You like, dude? Maybe they might yes, have. Yes, that's could, what happened. He's also the governor. He has a ton of other political rivals. You can't piss off the Jays like that. You, he shut it down. I've done dude. it. I haven't done a motherfucking thing, dude. What'd you do to the Jays? Cuomo's level. Slammed him, dude. When <laughs> you slam the Jays. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. He got fucked with after he did that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, dude, he's also got nine million other political rivals. Sure. But none of them matter except the fucking six, Orthodox. Six million. I mean <laughs> <laughs> already revised the five, but that doesn't matter. Possibly, dude. Chill, dude. What happened? <laughs> what do you say? Public that's public. This knowledge. is just what going from him public fighting. Yo, man, knowledge. you, you went public knowledge. Crap, you look it up. He went you from, can look it up. What? Bill? Don't get mad at me. Hold on. I'm not, we're not talking about it. What we're talking about is that listen, listen okay. to this. Okay, 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 okay. You come in here. Yes. You fight your brother about yes. who's more jacked. You can look that up. You talk about saying. COVID being yeah. fake right away. Yes. Now we're on to step three. <laughs> <laughs> where this always ends. <laughs> I'm, I'm shouting out the Orthodox Jays for slamming Cuomo like that. I, well, I agree. I hear you on this. I can't be critical of people? <laughs> you, you're, you're, you're free to legal? whatever you want. You're free to whatever you want, bro. I support your freedom. Thank you. Deal. Speak you know. freely, boys. You, I am. This is my Ludus. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> it is funny. Be like, dude, he pissed off Jewish people. Therefore, you're connecting dots, bro. I'm not connecting you're dots. You're connecting I'm just dots. That probably had a big fucking role in it. Maybe, dude. Maybe. Okay. Maybe. This has been going on for a year, and this just came out. Yeah. Why didn't they get him right away? Hey, dude. I'm just saying that was definitely a catalyst. No, you don't. You, you don't know. They were definitely the poll reviewers. You propagandized, dude. I'm not propaganda. You have to understand that you Saul have Revere. no idea what's going on. <laughs> Saul Revere. <laughs> Saul Revere. I know. I have no idea going on. It's the just, British it's are hilarious. coming. It's a funny <laughs> thing to think about. It is funny. Right after that, I mean, yeah, I, didn't, I, didn't know, I didn't know the guy put out a video I saying have, they'll litigate. Oh, they were, dude. They, they were, were freaking in New York. The fuck they out. were pissed, dude. He was yeah, shutting down everything. Tenacious, they were. Like, they dude, are. they were bringing out like Trump flyer. They, they had like Trump flags. At yes. the, they were like the Jays were wild. I'm not propagandized. I just pay attention. I yeah. see but all this going on. In Cuomo's defense, it was literally in the the height of COVID in New York, 
and the, everybody was like, you're locked down. You have to stay inside. Whether or not you believe it or not, the Jays were wiling. They were yes. out. They yeah. were having fun. I stand with and that. And everybody was like, these these goddamn Jews are having so much fun. Cuomo shut it down. And Cuomo, the, Cuomo sure. shut it down. Yes, dude. That's definitely a huge role. I wouldn't say definitely. I wouldn't speak in definite. That's my that's my alarm. If you screaming. watch that video, the guy claiming litigation on fucking Cuomo. Yeah, I told cops one time I was going to burn down the precincts. So yeah, but you like, don't know lawyers. Like, if you were lawyers. telling them, like, speak I'm going to slash your tires, like, you know guys in construction and stuff like that. Their connects are, like, lawyers, Private investigators, all that stuff. Like Possibly. That's how they fuck with you. Yeah, Matt was a PI. I was a PI, bro. You talking? You don't, you don't think he like, knows out and break stuff. My one friend's a lawyer, dude. Call him all the time. I'm just saying. <laughs> I was a PI. My friends were. I'm basically Jewish, dude. <laughs> All right, I have yeah, let's to roll. go for that show. Bill, incredible episode, man. Fantastic, dude. What are you smiling? You're the best. You're you the rule, best, dude. You are. I, the best. I do think summer 21 is. I, I, I think I was just messing with you. I was yanking your chain. I think it's yours. That's fine. With I don't or without, even need it honestly at this point. I don't even care. With Same or without apps, I think you're gonna. I probably care less. No. Nah. Secure, <laughs> secure a girlfriend. Yeah. Well, my. Tarot card reading said it March, like kind of, it'll happen. Where'd you get your tarot card ready? Uh, just on YouTube. Nice, hell yeah. Front load my fucking masculinity. <laughs> you got a tarot I'm card stuck, reading? What, what month do you think you're gonna find love? What month are you? I said March, but yeah. really Ooh, a little March madness. I don't know. <laughs> That's like big decisions are gonna come. Oh, <laughs> check that calendar, bud. <laughs> check that calendar. Here comes love coming right at you. I'm gonna have to ask you to not. Put my hands on you? Yeah, please. Good luck stopping this. <laughs> <laughs> you can grab me by my dick. <laughs> Dude, just before we go out, just get as close as you possibly can to each other's penises. No. Just nah. get close. No. That's, Matt, Matt, Matt close. that's, that's not very fucking yeah, self. Just for the people. It's just, fu- it's work on self. This, this is not a Hollywood. Dude, good. just a Hollywood Matt, magic. Tap each other's legs. Dude. That's not self-help. No. Come on. Come that's on. mean. You're being mean. You're, you're being homophobic. Goofy stuff I'm not being homophobic. You're being That's homophobic. Disgusting. I'm trying to homophobic. smash the barriers, dude. That's homophobic. not bigot. you guys. Are, bigot. The way you guys reacted about out that. Point out the bigot, Matt. All the I Hollywood will. greats would do it. The Hollywood. I will greats. say this: neither of us are I Hollywood piss on greats. Hollywood. Matt. The Candelabra, dude. This is not self help. <laughs> this is not self help. Come on, dude. I, I can't believe this my own brother is not self help. Wow. A lot of projection going on here. A lot of small self tax. Why? I'm 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 working for big champion minorities. What? <laughs> a champion minority. Yeah. Yeah. I wasn't even talking about that. Point out the bigot. I wasn't even talking Shut about that. Shut you something. down, dude. I just wanted you guys to go out on a fun little goof. I didn't think you guys would actually do it. What? I thought you guys were going to like just basically grub, like just pretend. You're trying to. You're not trying that to, it's wrong, but that's gay. You're trying to lower us to raise yourself <laughs> no, up. Not. You're trying to raise yourself up and no lower me and build down. Yeah. A little bit. That's would, crap. No way. That's crap. That'd be such a fun skit, dude. That's that's not not a you guys, there should be a thing of you guys like watching a football game together, You're like Chiefs jerseys, out. and just fucking You're slowly me out. high-fiving, <laughs> going for another high-five, and just fucking That was my, That was a skit. I, was that right? Yeah, I was pushing that. Yeah, like how NHL commercials are like woke now. Yeah. Like I was watching an NHL, or NFL does it too, where it's like, it should, it's like NFL gear, buy yeah. NFL gear, and it's like a family of Sikhs yeah. in like Broncos <laughs> uniforms, and then it's like a black lesbian couple watching like the Jets. Yeah. And then I was like, we should do it for NHL and then have one of just two dudes just violently going at it sexually. That's probably where I got that. Like guys in Maple Leafs uniforms like, ooh, 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 Or just ooh. fucking kissing, dude. Just yeah. like two stubbled men making out over chips. No so no music. Gross. Music cuts to hear them kissing. Dude, did you fuck with your mustache? No. Why does it look it's like just, you have a Fu Manchu? Oh, right here? Just the whole shit. Guys, there's nothing wrong with Fu Manchu. It's how it grows, dude. Is there anything else you guys want to criticize in I'm front of me? I just look like you fucked with it a little bit. Nah, are you, are you accusing me of trim, uh, grooming no, 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 my beard no, 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 here? Because no, no. we can talk about it's like beard too wax. Far of, it's too far apart. Because I got smacked in the face with a canoe paddle, bro. I'm sorry to hear it's that. It's a scar. I'm sorry to even bring so that up. Are you? I thought you were accusing me of maintaining my facial hair. No. Eh. What, you think I'm scared of that? Essential oils for your beard. It's good for you. I wouldn't say that. You wouldn't know. No, I wouldn't. You're going to grow a fucking shit stack. All right, chill. What? You guys have <laughs> only insulted each other with insults to me. <laughs> <laughs> God. Bill, I love you, dude. You're my brother. So I support you in all your endeavors. Yeah. I hope summer 2021 is yours, dude. Ours. <laughs> Hell yeah. Please cut that.